Well, it's game day. We got to make something good, right? So Absolutely. Mushrooms, stuffed mushrooms. Stuffed Sounds mushrooms. Great. Stuffed mushrooms are delicious. And uh, I guess you start with the mushrooms. You try to find some of the larger ones. You know, you can always go and buy individual. I bought a couple packs of the larger, yeah. of the packs of them. But you can buy the large mushrooms. And some people just take and they snap off the caps. And that works fine. But I think if you find and you use a good paring knife and you work and you pop underneath, then you can just kind of scrape and make yourself a bigger pocket. Okay. And, and I saw Merrill do these once, and the little guy had a, such a little hole in there, you couldn't stuff it with anything. <laughs> so if we kept on going on this, you can actually find yourself a nice little pocket. Yeah. And, you got, and, and, and the stuffing today is delicious. We're gonna do a little uh, 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 back to nature. Uh, wild rice, uh, walnuts, a little pinto beans, some currants, and leeks. Oh, okay. So that's kind of what I've mixed together here with some fresh mint. Wow. So that's, that's a unique combination going on You know something, there. you could actually take that whole mixture, add a can of cream of chicken soup, cream of mushroom soup, or cream of celery, and you can use it for a beautiful little stuffing. Wow. You know what I'm saying? For, 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 I love that. Now here, here's a little bit of uh, garlic and herb, uh, garlic and herb cheese. Yep. So we're going to take some garlic and herb cheese. Can I try a little piece Absolutely. of Absolutely. That's why I did that for you, hon. Thank you. We're going to grate a little garlic and herb cheese. Now, we could probably put that mixture in that mushrooms dry because, you know, if you ever did mushrooms on the grill, mm -hmm. they turn out, they get a lot of puddle of water in there. Yeah. Mushrooms are, whatever they are, 70, 80 percent water, just like everybody else and, and everything else. And, and so we probably didn't need any moisture in there, but the grated cheese is just going to add so much. So we took some of Renard's. This is really, really good, by Isn't the that way. wonderful mm -hmm. stuff? Okay. You know, I was going to do a, a blue cheese because mm -hmm. it'd be good in there, but not everybody likes blue cheese. No. I know this crew. This I know is a this winner. crew. So we're going to take our mixture and mix that up, and all we're simply going to do is take a couple of our mushrooms, all our mushrooms, and just pack it in there nicely. The best way to do mushrooms in the oven, 350 degrees for about 25 minutes, mm -hmm. or on the grill, indirect, no heat underneath it, so the heat's going to be on the two outside, mushrooms in the center, and I'll do them for about 30 minutes. Okay. Slow cook them. You want to slow mm. cook them so the mushrooms get done. You don't, yeah. want, you don't want them firm. You want them nice and, and soft. Yeah. It's, it, seriously, it looks like it's going to be awesome. I can't wait to try these. Um, you, okay, you said these are currants? Well, you know something. Raisins? I was trying to be a, 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 I was trying to be a, a Native American. They're right. raisins. They're darn raisins. They're raisins. They're like, raisins. Currants. But you know, but that's what current currants are just dried. Um. Yeah. Fruit. I get it. <laughs> I like, I'm excited for the sweet and the savory going on there. You know, Merrill's headed over and we're going to be at a place called Willie Beeman's. It's in Nina on Double I. It's west, it's in Nina, but it's a west of the highway. Mm -hmm. And, and we're going to be there from 11 till 3-ish. He's, he, he's got sweet corn, organic. Ooh. He's going to do last of the season organic sweet corn and a lot of tailgate fare. We're going to do some hors d'oeuvres. Sounds so. great. Sounds you great. You betcha. And make sure to check out their show on the CW14 on uh, Midwest Grillin' with Mad Dog and Merrill. It was filmed over at the Bart Star Plaza tailgate party. Oh, this is going to be a good one. Yep, well, absolutely. I mean, they're all good, but this will be fun. Yep, yep, yep. Perfect for game day. All right, we are going to take a quick break. You're watching Good Day Wisconsin.